Hello and thanks for joining me. Well, last week I did a video on belt splicing. Uh, the type of belt I covered was a synthetic belt, very good belt. It's made by Habasit, it's called F1. Uh, it's about one millimeter thick and unbelievably strong. Uh, anyway, uh, I've got an abundance of this belt. It's two inches wide and normally it sells for about eleven twenty-five a foot. That's a high price belt. Uh, but I got a good deal on it and I'm going to make it available for about five dollars a foot. Uh, for a reasonable price I will prepare the ends so you can splice it. It's a tapered grind. Or I can pre-glue it for you and you can it'd be endless it'll be a loop belt just like a regular v-belt uh, the advantage to splicing it yourself is if you've got a spindle that's hard to remove on a lathe you can run it thread it through and then make the splice you're done works great uh, there is some additional cost involved in making your own splice you got to buy the glue you got to buy a belt guide which i'm selling also uh, that's that's to keep it lined up while you're splicing and uh, you got to buy a hair straightener that's right hair straightener uh, the hair straightener is exactly the right temperature for uh, splicing these belts if you buy the commercial commercial belt iron for splicing it's like seven hundred dollars so uh, either way uh, I got you set um, in the uh, description area below, I've got a document that outlines how to order the belt. Basically, you answer a few questions, send me an email, and uh, I will send you a quote back. It's a no-obligation quote. If you don't want it, you don't, don't buy it. Anyway, I tried to make it as e easy as possible. I've got a couple links to the hair straightener and to the glue. Uh, like I said, there's some additional costs to splicing it yourself. Of course, once you buy the hair straightener and the glue and the belt guide, uh, it's a one-time cost. The glue is probably enough glue to splice 100 or 100 belts or more. Anyway, uh, that about wraps it up. Be sure and check it out. Check out the information below. Uh, it also has plans for this uh, belt grinder. Uh, but it's way easier to have me uh, grind the end. But if you want to grind your own belts, that's a cool little thing to make. Uh, but uh, there's some expense involved in that too. Um, but for five bucks, I will measure the belt exactly within an eighth of an inch. Prepare the ends, and you can you can make your own splice. Or for $10, I'll, I'll prepare the ends and splice it. And you'll receive a loop belt. Unbelievably cheap, let me tell you. Anyway, just passing on a good deal. Uh, be sure and watch last, uh, the last episode. Uh, it answers, it'll probably answer a lot of questions if you haven't seen it already. Anyway, thanks for joining me. Uh, be sure and subscribe and ring that bell.